Hello guys, hello and welcome to another episode of Hearts of Our 4 Modern Day Mod and the Kingdom of North Korea. Last episode we basically built up. <laughs> Nothing really exciting. We just basically sat and built up, made sure that we will be do something. Well, this episode really. And I think it's, well, I think it's time. If we justify our war goal against China, it's going to take 130 days. But because of our current equipment loss, I think I want to wait just a tiny bit more. Just to have some stockpile, because our infantry is most, most likely going to be attacked quite heavily right here. So I want to, I just want to make sure that they can actually withstand them for a while, even if it takes some losses. Well, for a while actually, for the entire time. It's actually better spoken. And I also have regret that having all of those divisions right there. I think I will just reassign him right here, so we have as much as possible, as close as possible right here. And then I'm gonna switch you out to go like this, very... Come on, right there, ah, there we go. I'm gonna do like, let's see, the purple, yes, you, my dear friend, you're gonna go and, well, focus a bit more right here. While you, my orange new friend, you're gonna go like this. So basically we're gonna split this up between two of these divisions. And we will see if we can do some kind of simultaneous push right here. You go up, you go right, and uh, well, we'll see how that goes. But for that, I will also need, well, a couple more divisions to say the least. I want at least like 12. I did not mean to press there. I was gonna tell you to go. Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it. That was actually really bad. Um, you're not filled with full of your equipment. You're not fully trained. Um, I'll have to fix that. Damn it. Crap. Ugh, mistakes were made. I'm almost... no, 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 let's not restart. I made a small mistake, but we can we can fix that. We can fix that. Uh, reliability, last one right there. Let's get it right now. And, oh, right, 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 as someone told me. Um, I'm probably gonna get nuked quite a bit, so let's... Let's make sure they nuke us in a position where it doesn't matter. Well, of course it matters, but I'm gonna make sure they don't nuke us where we... well... Where we're gonna take actually natural unity damage and similar things. So if we focus our entire air force right here, uh, do we have any more planes actually? Uh, actually 100 more, that's nice. Uh, let's just jump you up and just well, boost up both of these to 300 each then. I don't know why I want it equal, it probably doesn't matter but still. I'm gonna boost up everything right here, I'm gonna get a couple of radar stations. Uh, let's say two, uh, let's put one right there and one right there. And then I'm gonna just fill up this entire thing with anti-air guns. And oh, actually, that's perfect. <laughs> 15 factories on every single thing right here. 104 days for all the anti-air to be done, 22 for all this to be done. And then we have some, well, ports to build up. But we can we can probably wait a tiny bit. I think it's gonna be safe if we just hold the front line. If they do some kind of naval invasion, then I should be able to react quick quick enough to be able to stop it. Uh, we have the recruitment strategies, very good. Uh, let's go down and get the dockyards right now. Uh, let's see, all of you guys, you are 7 divisions right now, you are gonna need to be a hell of a lot more than that. Uh, get the lost anti-tank guns right there, we are also gonna just make sure that we switch out. Uh, Alright, let's make a nice anti-air guns right there to level 3, thank you. God, it's gonna take a while to fill up everything, but it's gonna be worth it, I think it's gonna going to be worth it. Uh, let's see, <laughs> the least anti-air, then more and more and more, yeah, cool. Uh, anything else I can do? Should I start justifying right now? No, I think we're gonna start justifying as soon as... Actually, we won't need that long of a time. That's gonna take 220 days. I want about 50 days of just production. Well, just stockpile, basically. So, we'll have to wait a bit longer. Mm, I don't know exactly when, but we will declare this war this on the during this session. Uh, let's see. Otherwise, right here, did we build a fort? Yeah, we did. A level five fort right there. That's awesome. Uh, right here, yes. Keep keep building up everything. Actually, why? Why? Let's just get a let's get a radar station in every single one of these provinces. Why not? I want complete control of this area because if you nuke me right here, I shouldn't lose any natural unity. It's not core territory. It's only co a colonial state. So. Sure, I'm gonna lose civilian factories, I'm gonna lose military factories, I'm gonna lose infrastructure. But I should not lose any kind of natural unity or lose if they well manage to grab enough right there. This needs to be locked down extremely, extremely much. So let's ho hopefully make sure that that works fine. 
what 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 did I say right there? Hopefully that that l ma looks fine. I I don't know really what he said right there, but yeah, lock down this territory. That's what we need to do, and that's what we're going to do. Uh, we are at very high taxes, very good. That's where we're gonna stay. And any guy, we we might want to switch out silent work horse. Uh, yeah, didn't we have one guy, or did we all get the fort defense guy? Uh, right here. Let's see, military factory, land fort. Yes, we did. Uh, I'm thinking maybe road builder. Oh wait, 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 aren't there, aren't there one guy actually for ceiling factory, infrastructure and refinery? No, I think it isn't there one for anti-air guns or is this also the fort guy? Yeah, it is. Anti-air plus 40%. Never mind, never mind then. Uh, radar stations does not exist right there, so we can't ignore that. Naval bases, smooch armings, so nope, nope, nope. Maybe there wasn't anything for me to pick them. I'm pretty sure there was something I, I was gonna switch out. Huh, maybe not. Oh, right, 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 right. Uh, I was gonna do this. So I'm switching out this one. We have 40% longer justification time, which is gonna time this pretty perfectly. Because, well, then we're gonna have 205 days, and I agree to that. So in 205 days, we are declaring war against China. So the question is, how much are they gonna, well, be able to prepare during that time? Probably quite a bit. And I'm a bit afraid that this will is failing, well, ending complete failure, but um, we need to do it. We need to do it. If we wait much longer, they're just going to be much stronger than us. We have just taken down India. We are in prime condition right now. Our divisions did really, really well, and I, I don't think I can... Sure, I can just sit and wait forever and then be sure of my victory eventually. That's not how I play the game. I have fallen a bit from grace and from my very aggressive tactics. It's time I return. It's time I return to where I came from. Where I've begun. <laughs> uh, let's pull an um, aggressive order right there and let's do it very carefully if I'm ever gonna execute it. I don't think so. Uh, you need to switch down right here. You 25 divisions, you're most likely only gonna be defense, so you are supposed to be moved up. Very good. And you guys need to train a tiny bit. So uh, let's train that. Oh god, it's actually quite a bit you have to train. Then let's just do like this. Uh, you, you, come on, all of you. Just reassign a bit quickly. You, train up. Uh, resource slot available. Uh, we're done with everything right there. Super good. Super, super, super good. And let's see, what else can we pick? What else can we pick? Uh, last one right there, sure. But don't we have anything better to do? No, I don't think so. More soft attack, I guess, could also be useful. Um, nope, not there. Any more defense? Oh yeah, more defense. Holy shit, we can take two of them. So yeah, that's definitely what we're gonna do. Ex well, with you two, probably. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else. So yeah, pick this one too. Just increase the defense and breakthrough of every one of our units. It's a bit weird that defense give breakthrough. Maybe you're more brave and, well, want to charge or dare to charge. So I guess maybe it makes a bit sense. Uh, new administration law. Yes, uh, excellent suggestion. Yes, definitely. Come on, can we get up to high stability before we declare war? Come on, come on, give me the event. I have no clue what we are at. Well, our current stability is at. I have completely forgotten to, well, kind of keep a head count of that. Um, so, ah, it doesn't seem like I got high enough stability. Too bad. Uh, let's see, you guys. Uh, you kind of need to be deployed right now, but we do have more days. We do have another 170 days before we declare the war. Damn it, China. You're gonna, well, you start mass producing, mass deploying everything to really defend. I really hope we have enough right now. Having around two divisions each right here on every single province, that should be enough. And right here, I basically just want one for this entire age. Um, why are not all of you deployed? Oh, right, 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 because I, yeah, you're not supposed to train. I don't want to waste that equipment. And you just have a tiny bit more, then I'm just going to take all of you and just reassign like this. And come on, just you left. Get everything you need. Uh, let's see, currently in motorized rocket artillery, we are fine. In mechanized, we are fine. In tanks, we are fine. Uh, stability change, boom. Thank you. That was really, really good. Let's check. High stability, tons of good bonuses. 
zero, actually we're at minus two right now, so we don't actually need that justification war goal guy to get zero percent consumer goods. Wow, that's amazing. We finally reached that beautiful, beautiful number that you can achieve in modern day mode. Zero percent consumer goods, oh actually, well, minus two now, as I said. But yeah, cool, thank you, thank you so much for that. Uh, that's gonna be really, really useful for us. Uh, let's see, are we in need of any resources? No, we're trading with steel and we're trading with Germany, so that shouldn't be interrupted by anything. Actually, let's, yeah, no, never mind. Let's, oh, wait, wait, we don't have to, we don't have to use convoys to trade with Germany? That doesn't make sense. Oh, are we really taking this land way? Wow, wow, that's, that's, that, wow. <laughs> uh, let's see, that was another, where? Another 11 divisions. Oh, right. I was going to produce 14 additional ones. Why? I was going to produce 14 additional ones for some reason. Oh, right. Now I remember. Oh, God. That was lucky. I was so close to forget about it. Uh, so you are going to well cover this. And this area. Actually, that is not necessary. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7... And you are supposed to be one less right here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wait, wait, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh god, then I don't need one of these divisions. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Oh god, we are actually losing. <laughs> we're missing so much equipment right now. Uh, actually, it's mostly infantry weapons. And I haven't upgraded you. Let's upgrade you, even if that's going to be a slight penalty for us. We do have some days left. Hmm. Well, of course, if it goes really badly, we can just reassign a couple of people to the other front. That's seven divisions. Let's just move over with all of you. Basically, if this front line goes badly, we can take some of these divisions and just reassign up here. But hopefully, we it won't. Hopefully, it won't go bad. <laughs> of course. Uh, maybe we can skip. We could skip all this one division. And just, if anyone arrives at this position, these guys along with this one can attack. And that would save me some time. So, yeah, let's do it. So one last guy, you're going to be deployed right there, and then we're done. One, two, three, four, five, and then let's just... Come on, come on, let's stop messing. Like this. Thank you. So you have a single province naval invade me in, but it's going to be surrounded instantly if anything ever lands right there. Better anti-tank guns, please give me them. Where are you? Right there. God, we're really just boosting up everything now to the top of the line right now. That's, it feels very nice that just before we do everything, then we're ready. And there we go, you are finished training, and you guys just join up right here. We have 11 divisions right now, oh no, 9 divisions right here. Uh, you should actually have a commander, even if it's just, a, oh good. Oh wait, 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 you are supposed to have that guy. I don't care that he's old guard, more entrenchment speed, or more entrenchment, so yeah, definitely. Holy shit, how could I have almost forgotten about him? No clue, but thank god we fixed him. Uh, there we go, a level 2 commander right there. You're gonna control all of them. Oof, that was close. 30 entrenchment, that's not something to play around with. It's 30 entrenchment. It's gonna make a massive difference. Uh, let's see, have we finished all the naval forts? Wait, didn't we get naval forts right here? No, we only got naval forts at the different, yeah, at the different ports it's, uh, and themselves. Okay. Uh, infrastructure right here isn't the best, but I don't want it to be the best. If they enable invade me, it should only be possible for me to support my troops. But right here, it's not super good. Uh, let's see if we can fix that a tiny bit. So you're gonna get a level 10 port right here. And a level 10 right there. And we are gonna have to just... We're gonna just fix the infrastructure right here, because you're gonna get nuked. They're, like, there's no question about it. You are gonna get nuked. So it's actually, wow, wow, that's, I might overdo that a tiny bit. Uh, let's just cancel all that infrastructure. And just find something actually better to do. Uh, what is the limiter right here? Uh, it's a naval, naval base limit, okay, cool. Then I, instead of doing that, I'm just going to do, let's see, double port like this. And let's see, anything else we can do? Hmm. Anything else we can do. Oh, right, an airbase right there. I want a level 10 airbase while at my capital, hopefully. So I can just reassign all of these planes at a single position. We have all the anti-air anti we possibly can get. Um, we could just get some split anti-air right here. Even if it's, well, basically nothing. 
I don't know exactly how the AI thinks about anti-air guns. Maybe they will just ignore them completely. Or if they think, oh, they have anti-air gun right there, maybe we should not put our planes right there. So I'm thinking maybe I can limit their plane use to, well, a small island like this. Let's take, take away that one and just really try to, maybe, maybe we can trick the AI somehow and, oh, that area is free, let's go over there. Oh, that area has a ton of anti-air guns, let's not go there, let's only focus here. No, not there. Not, and just really just trick it and mess around with it. I don't know if it works, but... Um, <laughs> I'm sure as hell gonna try. So, how long before this is okay? Oh god, 100 days. Uh, I'm not ready. I am not ready. Well, or more like, I am ready for this. Everything I've done is for this war. Because once we're finished right here, we can continue with Japan and the United States. We are ready for this war. Can I improve it anymore? I could give it more time, but that's the only thing. And given her more time, technically, China should be able to just become a hell of a lot stronger than us. We have given it enough time. I think we're, we have very quickly rolled into a position where we probably can't challenge them. So I want to see what happens. You guys just get out there as soon as you're done. Not anything else. Everyone that, well, are going to finish after the entire war has been declared, you're just going to stay right here in Northern Korea. And we'll see if we can, well... Maybe push out right here, bring down a couple of divisions, maybe a small surround, or just generally push a bit. Yeah, we'll see. Uh, right here, you actually have a ton of divisions signed. Ooh, I don't like that. But we do have a level 5 forts basically everywhere. Everywhere, actually, right there too. Oh god, we really just have, <laughs> we have really just fortified up like hell. Ooh, that's awesome. Uh, one thing we could do is just get a level 2 fort everywhere right here just something really uh, we will probably not finish them but during the war we might finish them let's see and uh, level 2 right here and accept this single province oh we actually got a <laughs> level 3 right here <sighs> whatever let's just get one more division uh, otherwise I would become super irritated on this front line it's like why, why make it almost perfect when you can make it perfect? Okay, not p perfect, perfect, but whatever. You understand what I mean. Uh, let's see, modern, there you go. And uh, let's see, can we continue? What was it really? Fatigues? Huh. Um, no, nothing right there. That's out of the question. Nope. Nope. Um, anything right? Yeah, that, sure, let's pick that one. It's ahead of time, but it's gonna be good ahead of time. Let's see. Yeah, we're good on time. Excellent. Uh, South Sea Negotiation. Wow, I really don't like the name of that focus. That's v Vietnam. Yeah, that's a, a hell of a lot, of a lot of stuff right here that might be, well, turning against me. And, well, I have already taken down Vietnam, wasn't you right here? Yeah. So, uh, I'm just hoping something won't... Oh, we are joining you in a faction right now, and that makes my occupation illegal or something. I don't know how all the focuses work in modern day mod, so I don't know what might happen, and I would like to avoid it. Hopefully, me being at war with them will stop any kind of shenanigan tra shenanigans to happen. Uh, let's go right here, Battlefleet Concentration. Actually, before that, can we fix better battleship missile cruisers? Oh, nope, then let's get that one. Uh, we have 12 visions right here. Oh, right, it's just, yeah, you're getting zoomed up in that state. Never mind, never mind. Uh, let's see. Slowly done with one more. I said I wanted around 12. We have 12 right now, so that's pretty good focus and pretty good timing. Uh, we have another, god, 45 days, okay. Unfulfilled important request. Germany suddenly don't want to give us any. Okay, then we will just stop giving you anything. Hello, Japan. I hear, hear you want my game. <laughs> want to give me a couple of steel. Oh, actually, that's probably worse. Russia. Don't you have any steel you want to give to me? Uh, let's see details. Oh, you have to close the economy. No, you most, most certainly doesn't want to give me any steel then. Uh, let's see. Foreign can't anything right here that I wanted? No, not really. Then let's just grab the last stockyards too. Thank you. 
There we go. That should be enough for all those planes. Thank you. Then we just unite them again. I don't know if it will make any difference, but it shouldn't. Uh, red dot site, very good. Then let's just continue with even more. Holographic site. Dun 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 dun. It really is closes in around us. The time. The really big challenge is coming up right now. Taking down Japan will be uh, not super difficult, to be honest. But then we have Japan or United States after that. We will have to naval invade. And that's going to be the difficult part. And then secure a good position. And it will also spark the war with NATO, which means Canada is going to join. And basically everyone here in Europe. So yes, they can just take all of their troops and just ship them over to the United States. God, that's going to be really, really hard to break. But if we manage to bring down China, all that lovely, lovely, in in okay, maybe not, not all of it, but much of that infrastructure is going to go to me, and I will be able to, well, summon a real army worthy of North Kingdom of North Korea. Huh. I was totally not at all thinking of Lord Rings right there with that quote. Uh, okay, you will be the last one I deploy right there. So actually, I'm just going to pull you out right there and then just cancel all of this. To just make sure that I don't accidentally send them over. Because when China have... Well, China will get the naval superiority right here. And they will completely slaughter me. So I just need to make sure that... Well... I don't lose any division or any troops from there. And that actually makes sense. Well, with that new field marshal we have right here. We just deploy all our troops... Well, directly to the front line. Because you have enough space for them. 24 out of 60. Uh, currently, strength... You can see this small bar right here. It checks the strength about the other front line, and it's exactly 50-50 right here. And this one, we have slightly more than 50-50. And about this one, here we actually have a complete advantage. Really, I don't, I don't. Really, complete advantage. I don't know. Maybe a bit of an advantage. No, that division should be quite similar to mine. 5, 6, you have 4, yeah, you don't have that much mechanized, we're having a lot more armor than they have, but I doubt it that, well, basically, you can't pierce my armor, we only have uh, 67, but a lot of hardness, which is super good, <sighs> alright, no more delays, but I still believe that we should have the first strike right here. So if you can, please do it. Just let's be balanced. Let's declare this war. And... Okay, green most places. One red spot, which I do not like. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna pull back one of these visions and help right there. Alright, we will be at war with <laughs> Republic of Shine. No, no, not at all. Was it, who was it? Was the Republic of Korea? No, 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 no. Who, who, who the hell joined that war? I thought it said Republic of something. Oh, oh, confused. Then, never mind then, never mind then. I'm happy. Whatever. Uh, you're not attacking me right here. You're not, you're actually attacking me right here. Holy shit. Uh, yeah, you guys need to get up right there ASAP. Uh, one of the divisions, get over there. Okay, there we go. So come on, come on, what the hell was that? The Chinese Union of Socialists. Oh, that was... You created a faction. Okay. <laughs> uh, actually, we are we are beating this back. Quite handily. Oh, shit. We are really kicking the crap out of them, to be honest. Uh, we have no nukes on our... Well, on our ground right now, at least. We are doing fine. We just have enough air superiority, so they won't be able to nuke us. Cool. And this guy, let's just deploy ahead of time and ignore it so we can actually fill up this entire front. God, if you just keep attacking us there constantly, then we won't be able to hold it. Uh, any of these units done soon? Well, quite soon. Hopefully that would be enough. Supply-wise, we are just good enough, but not in infantry weapons. Oh, crap. That's a big mistake. That's a very big mistake. Um, I need to fix it. With I need to fix it, I mean I need to fix it. God, I really don't like doing this, but... We are going to do it. Let's double our infantry weapons right now. Because that's the basis of our entire army. All that mechanized we have is, well, requiring also quite a bit of, well, 
infantry weapons, and if they're bad, well, it simply just won't end well. Let's just say that. <laughs> um, otherwise, we're doing really fine right here. Okay, we're breaking them right there. Let's see, current losses, 100,000 versus 200. So, as you can see, we are not doing, like, ridiculously well. We're doing, we're doing super good, but not ridiculously well, which I had hoped for. Now, oh, yeah, right here, you're attacking me, and uh, we are s precisely holding on. But it's going back and forth constantly. Uh, I want you to be very careful now when you attack. Because every single attack should be only in the most prime of condition. Okay, we're breaking that division, which means we're going to unite this, which means you guys, you four divisions right here, you can join up right there. I think. Or, no, no, I was a bit too hasty right there. Um, okay, I will have to do something I shouldn't do. But yeah, you break right here. God damn, I'm going to stretch my line before I actually have the troops enough to stretch it. And you need to attack right here to basically just cover up for my mistake right there. Uh, these divisions have too short of a front line, so I need to increase you with a couple of places and you need to be reduced now with a couple of them because, well, I changed the front line. There we go, very good, right here. You have not broken us, good, very, very good. Uh, Supply-wise, we are, well, super supporting everything, yes, but we are missing a hell of a lot of infantry weapons. Oof, I don't like that. I really don't like that. Uh, can we fix that somehow? Can we fix that somehow? Yes, we can, kind of. Uh, let's just add everything right here, a complete new line, and one new line of infantry weapons. Just get that. Get that now, really. We need it. Fix it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> um, losing convoys should not be a problem. We have exactly for this reason you saved up. So even if you destroy half my convoys, I will have, still have twice the amount left. Uh, <laughs> it would have made no absolute sense, but uh, whatever. It doesn't have to make sense in times of war. Just don't lose. Things don't have to make sense. Just don't lose. <laughs> God. Um. Well, what the hell has happened right here? Yeah, that's correct. I see no divisions right here. Push very, very carefully very very freaking carefully and why have you lost basically all of your equipment attrition did you attack me right here and i didn't even notice it maybe oh crap that was actually really bad how could i not have noticed that <sighs> luckily we held <laughs> that could have ended really badly uh let's see you are constantly oh god we're losing more and more and more we need more factories on it Damn it, I don't want to remove any more mechanized. I don't want to renew, remove any more mechanized. I can't remove more mechanized. Uh, okay, let's just... Every single factory possibly might capture. Just fix this infantry deficit. We can't have a des deficit in something that every single one of our division needs. Uh, in the meantime, that happens. Oh, right, I already put you on being very careful. Yeah, you're still supposed to be that. And you're also supposed to be very careful right there. Uh, they are Eastern India. You're trying to naval invade me right here. No surprise right there. No surprise in you trying to naval invade me. That's what I tried to say, but failed in that miserably. Um, we will need to pull some forces to be able to cover that shit. Um, I can't really use these divisions because they are basically spent for some reason. You're really missing a ton of equipment right there. Um, but yeah, you're coming in right now. So let's scramble together some troops from both of these divisions. That's six divisions. All of you get down right here ASAP. ASAP. That's being very slowly. Uh, Borneo. Yeah, I basically abandoned this entire place. Sure, take it. But East India. Yeah, we can't accept this. You are supposed to be mine still. Uh, we need a new commander. Thank you. You're gonna be level 2 because I told you. There we go. Now let's just charge in right now. That should be possible. Yeah, remove them. Bye bye. Thank you. A couple more divisions. And we have another assault right there. S Southern China. Let's. That's fine. C can you move down right here? That would be. I would appreciate it. Uh, let's see, we are at least... Oh god, we're not even stopping that current infantry deficit. Um, it's only becoming larger and larger. 
Uh, we're not getting anything from there anymore. Uh, let's trade with US because, well, what's wrong with some war profiteering? And there we go. Nukes have fallen upon me. Wait, wait, what? 30, 35%? What? Did you actually manage to nuke me right here? Holy crap, you did, I think. No, that's that that's just to see bombing. You should not have... Wh why am I losing natural unity? I should not be losing any natural unity at all. I'm holding my provinces and this is just colony bullshit. I should not be losing any natural unity from this being nuked. At least I'm pretty goddamn sure I shouldn't be losing anything from it. Okay, just for safety reasons then, we have to defend everything. With everything, I mean everything. Uh, you guys just move in right here. But, yeah, generally right here, we're just pushing in right now. It seems like as revenge, everyone else is just doing excellent. Even surrounding units without me be doing anything. And I am actually losing natural unity from this. I, I don't think I'm, I'm supposed to. Uh, okay. Safety reese, safety picks right now. Um, I don't need you anymore. Uh, anything that give me natural unity, please. That's 5%, don't we have a better one? Someone that gives me 10%, I'm pretty sure there is one. Nope, not there, popular figure, right there. Thank you, that's 25, and then we're gonna switch out one more guy. Let's see, we are at precisely zero. Yeah, then I wanna stay right there. So instead of switching out you, I will probably just switch out you, my dear war industrialist. We're not going to produce very many more, well, factories most likely. If we get any more, we're going to steal them. So I think I'm going to pick this guy, yeah. So we're going to be locked at 30%, or probably 25% once they've nuked me a couple more times. Just to be able to, even if, we, if we're going to lose, because what if they take something right here, and that also counts for my, well, also counts for my... Losing progress, then that would be horrendously bad. So I want to have some... Well, I want to have a short time to be able to react to it, at least. If they made me right here and take my capital, I'm dead. So, basically, if this counts for my surrender progress as well, I still want some time to be able to defend against it. Uh, does it... Yeah, I'm still losing natural unity. What the hell? That doesn't make sense. Um, I think I'm supposed to be able to be nuke down 10%, then those gonna, the other things are gonna just be bonuses that can't be reduced, so I should be stuck at 25%. Um, we just finished off the last reliability, very good. Anything right here that we can go for? Nope, 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 ah, uh, maybe. Let's see, anything right here industry-wise? 380 days, that's a bit too Oh, here, heavy equipment. Just... Getting that resource gain efficiency, plus 10% more. Uh, did we clean up all of this? No, we didn't. It's just we have so familiar colors right there. At least far uh, far away. So let's just clean up all of this. Eastern India. Okay, let's keep an eye open right there. That's why also I'm not reassigning these divisions back to where they should be. Let's just keep them right here. Just in case until we have basically broken them. There we go. Just clean up those two, two lost provinces right here. Um, really, China, you're getting volunteers from both Japan and Russia. Damn it. Damn it, I was maybe hoping for to actually get some volunteers from them myself, but apparently not. Seems like they think I'm more evil than they are. Well, in this case, I'm almost, almost in agreement with them. I'm just attacking people left and right. Uh, let's boost that up. You guys, yeah, you're supposed to be very careful, so stay at it. Uh, let's see, supply-wise right here. Oh, God, it's not really that that great. Uh, let's see, bump up that one to three steps and bump up that one step at least. Okay, two steps. Level four at least everywhere, please. Yep, cool. And uh, now I think I'm actually going to do something a bit more aggressively. I'm going to jump up with these two to, well, being a bit more aggressive again. See if we can break them, actually. And I actually have to end this episode right now. Holy shit. Um, I'm going to come out with a new series later today. So look forward to that one. And uh, well, I hope you enjoyed this episode. That you like and subscribe. And that was... Oh, wait, wait. Let's check losses first before end. 163 versus 1 million. So we did fix that. We did fix that problem. We were a bit more carefully, careful. Slowly pushed up a bit more. And just really nailed down our defenses. And we also did those two wipes with naval 
naval um, invasion, so that was really good. Other otherwise, now, thank you guys for joining me for this episode. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. And bye.